could Kabbalah later simply take its place next to the other teachings and be like, you know, like there's Buddhism, Hinduism, it will never be like other teachings because they're all built within the ego. They don't take a person out of the ego. They don't have the means for it. They don't have the upper light that works on a person and changes them don't have that light start practicing buddhism you'll never feel the ascents and descents that we do those that throw you and turn you inside out when you start hating yourself and hating the ego and the world and mainly it all pushes you towards the spiritual birth no such method there is nothing that can draw invoke the upper light upon a person you can say whatever but it doesn't happen and thus, there will be nothing besides Kabbalah and all the other methods will gradually simply dissolve. And religion will turn into culture. And those methods too, they'll turn into culture. Eventually, they're also culture. There'll be yoga, why not, and different dancing, singing, all these things coming from human culture and different rituals and everything, it will all become a culture. A person won't believe it. A person will feel that there is nothing about it besides such an expression of uh, one's own earthly psychology, and that's it. There are many different ancient rituals, uh, including song and dance, and look, today they simply turned into culture. Previously, there was no such thing. Look at, um, uh, suppose, African rituals, their song, dance, it's all ancient humanity. Where did it all come from? The, all of it, that's uh, rituals part of idolatry having to do with uh, the summoning of uh, spirits, mitigating evil spirits and so on. Later on, it all took on a cultural form, the expression of one's own emotions. And the same with books in the past. Were there books about love, about adventures or something? There were only religious type of books. And later, humanity grew out of it like out of uh, the cult rituals of song and dance and once again start basing on that its culture in order to simply express oneself as a human and we'll come to the point where today's religions and the different beliefs all of them will turn into such cultural creations cultural expressions of humanity into culturality Mm, that's it. And the only thing that will remain is Kabbalah that ties a person with the upper force that corrects him. The influence of which he invokes upon himself and thus constantly ascends higher and higher and all the rest it will turn into culture. And you needn't do anything about it. By no means. Everything will automatically fall into place in the cultural realm of humanity and will live together with it. No problem. If I come to visit a friend of mine and he performs his dance or song before me or I sing together with him the same as we sing in a Russian style together or a South American style, different songs and so on, but they all speak about our spiritual aspirations. Does it disturb anyone? On the contrary. It gives us a greater sense of our mutuality, connection, and love. Meaning, all this can connect people instead of separating them. And religions, why not? Why should these rituals separate? I already see its beginning. For instance, Clinton's daughter married a Jew so at the same time they had at the wedding a priest and a rabbi and there's another similar wedding going on there and what rituals why not do it together it's uh, human culture has nothing to do with religion or anything else nothing